for the first time I saw him at LaDonna Briggs' booth. <laughs> Hello, I'm Yvonne, and welcome to having you on. I get to share Tony with you. I thought you may enjoy seeing him for this week's Theme Thursday announcement. He's going to help me for the theme. And it is a theme that was requested this week, and I wanted to make sure that I got it in. So here we go. It's time for some knits or crocheted or anything made of yarn. And I wanted to share Tony in this little sweater that I saw him in for the very first time I saw him. And hang on, I have this week not one, but two alternative themes. So hang on for that and go check your calendars, get to find out what this theme Thursday is gonna be extra special because it falls right on the day. <laughs> go check it out, I'll tell you in just a moment. If you don't know, so you don't have to check your calendars. Let's see, what did I do? Okay, oh, I have it pinned here. So I will unpin it and I can get him in it. I hope that you all have been doing well. I was talking about last week, uh, some of my goals for this coming year and I decided I want to get more and more organized and today I went through my passies that I had they're not mine not me <laughs> they're, for, they're for my reborns and I started organizing them and grouping them together according to uh, similarities to them like I put my vintage passies all together and I separated them according to kind of themes going on so I could find them easily. It uh, it really helps, it really helps to do that. I keep them all in one big drawer, well actually two big drawers, I separated them boy and girl and doesn't, doesn't he look great in this, he looks so cute. And so I separated them boy and girl and then I decided I would divide them even more. Um, so I could find them a certain ones when I was looking for and it's really funny this week because I had set aside one that I plan to use this week last week and now I can't find it. I know I'll find it right after this video but uh, there's a reborn that I wanted you to see with it but you'll have to wait then <laughs> oh he looks adorable oh he does he looks adorable I think it works doesn't it it looks it looks very sweet on him it also came with some leggings, but I, they're more for a girl, so I'm not really going to put them on because they have a flower right there. So I'm going to not include those, but he did come with some other accessories. He came with this hat, and so I'm going to put the hat on him. So let's see the hat on him. There we go. Oh, <laughs> He looks so precious and he has these little mitts and I'll put them on keep him from scratching himself also keep his little hands warm man is it getting cold and get your hands so cold and keep them warm so I'm gonna put the little mitts on him yeah here we go oh perfect weather for mitts too oh oh doesn't he look so precious oh <laughs> hope that you enjoyed seeing him and come along with me and you can see more reborns here are my sandy twins they've been so busy around the nursery trying to help me get ready for this video hell i had to stop what i was doing and just pay attention to them so i wanted to share them with you so you could see them for this week's theme thursday they are all set look at morgan in this what i would believe would be a vintage little knit top and at the very top is a little blue bunny. It's so cute. And look at how handsome Huey looks in this sweater. He's so set for this theme. <laughs> Looking adorable. I hope that you enjoyed seeing them. Come along with me. And I would love to introduce the alternative themes to you this week because there's two. <laughs> But I want to also share a haul with you. I have a little mini haul, and I'm just going to share it with you right now. I found this dress. It's for one of my toddlers, and it's just so precious. Look at all that embroidery on it. I just thought it was so sweet, and oh, 
all those little roses it's just so pretty i just really fell in love with that and i also found this little janie and jack little dress and i love the color combinations of navy with pale pink and i also found this little top dress whatever it could be <laughs> And it says love on it. And I just thought it was fun. I especially like the shade of pink on it. Well, come along with me and I would love to share with you the themes. Well, the alternatives. Themes, that is. So here Here's we go. Here's my guy Sam. And yes, he is holding one of my vintage pasties that I had. Because I was going through them and I knew exactly where they were and when. I put them in this outfit. I thought, I think that pasty matches i think it goes with it pretty well and he is also wearing what i first saw him in but he's also here to help out for the alternative theme announcement and as i was sort of stating before when i was sharing tony it's time to share your reborns in their original outfits outfits that you may have seen him in for the very very first time when you fell in love with them. Well, come along with me because there's another alternative to go along with this. So here we go. Is Abigail. <laughs> and you know that this Thursday is Groundhog Day, February 2nd. That's why there's two alternatives to go along with this week's theme. But the second alternative is because I don't know if there's any little groundhog outfits out there, but I know that there is some hedgehog outfits. I know it's not the same thing, but I thought it'd be fun to sort of put a little twist on it and have a little sense of humor about the whole thing. <laughs> and dress your reborns in some hedgehogs for the alternative thing, the second alternative, that is, because it's falling on February 2nd, and I thought it would be perfect to have two alternative themes as well as some hedgehogs. And this sweet little outfit I got from Suzanne, <laughs> it's so cute, on Abigail. And have fun with this week's alternative themes to go along with the things <laughs> just so much fun just go dig in your dolly wardrobe and see what you find and share your reform for this week's theme thursday and it's groundhogs <laughs> that's why i wanted to include uh, outfits that you when you first saw your reborn and if you have you know all about the movie you kind of repeat the day so that's what i wanted to do sort of a repeat of the day and the first day that you saw your reborn in a particular outfit that you fell in love with. And it also means an outfit that you dressed your reborn in that you fell in love with your reborn. You know what I mean? <laughs> and come along with me and I have some more reborns to share with you. Here is Millie Rose. I was looking through my dolly wardrobe and I came upon this cute little sweater, little matching booties, and I thought it'd be perfect to share her for this week's theme Thursday, having to do with anything to do with yarn, <laughs> anything made out of yarn. And look at the little details going on right here. I just love this. <laughs> Looks like little petals going down. And then it also is very sparkly. I don't know if you can tell through the camera but it is has a little bit of sparkle to it i'll try moving a little bit see it just a little sparkle going on and i just thought it was so precious to dress her in this and i hope that you enjoy seeing her and have lots of fun this week looking for <laughs> items in your dolly wardrobe and share your reborn for this week's theme thursday it's going to be so much fun to see the reborns in the community come along with me and i have someone else you would love to see here we go here is penny and you'll notice what she's wearing has little farm animals all over her sweater <laughs> it would have worked really well for last week's theme thursday as well but i just love this sweater it is so soft it's a uh, ralph lauren is very sweet on her i had to include these little booties too they have pom-poms on them <laughs> so cute Come along with me and I have someone else I would love for you to see. Here we go. And let me catch my camera. <laughs> Here's my reborn toddler, Leigh And I didn't know if I had anything for her for this week's theme Thursday. But I was looking around my dolly wardrobe and I came up on this sweater. And I just love it on her. I had no idea that it was her size. And I just put it on her. And there it is. It just fits her so well. I love the details that it has on it. It has sweet little flowers at the top. And of course she found the pom-poms. It has to have pom-poms. 
and I have this little headband for her that is handmade out of yarn going on at the top there and it would be perfect for her and I hope that you have lots of fun with this week's theme but I have one more for you to see so come along and you get to see oh it's Azrael so here we go here is sweet Azrael and he's set for this week's theme Thursday in this knit jumper <laughs> staying all warm and snuggly and that's also another nice thing about this theme i was so happy when it was requested because it gives me a chance to do a little repeat for groundhog day because we had done this theme fairly recently i thought it'd be fun let's do a little repeat for groundhog day <laughs> Do take care of yourselves. Theme Thursday. Bring the community together one theme day at a time. I'm Yvonne. Thank you so much for watching. Having you on. Please subscribe for more so you don't miss. <laughs> That's all for now. The Reborn Feel Good channel.